Good morning, friends. Happy Friday. It's just me for a minute. Preston fell, so we'll see if he comes back down, if he can change his attitude in a few minutes here. I am going to paint this um, adorable double-sided uh, shelf sitter today with you guys. It would be perfect for your fall decor um, for fall and for Halloween because it's double-sided so you can flip it over. Let me point you down here and show you the Halloween side of it. So one side of it's going to say trick-or-treat and we're going to have the little jack-o-lanterns on there. And then let me show you, well I can leave this part on here, I got double pieces for that. And I'll show you the other side here um, that says happy harvest. So the second side will say happy harvest. And then we got a couple of cute little pumpkins on this side as well. So this will be the second side of the sitter. And then I didn't cut it out yet, but there is a little piece on the bottom so that it actually will sit up on your shelf um, once we're done with it. So I think we're going to start with the pumpkin side the jack-o-lanterns today make sure you say hello when you hop on I see people on here but it doesn't it hasn't shown me who's here yet maybe I'm not even seeing comments I'm not sure I'm gonna set this back up here for a minute do not lean again Scooch over, you're not gonna be on me and you're not gonna be rude. All right. So we're gonna get started with this side this morning. And if you are interested in painting this yourself, there is a link up in the description. It's available on my website. Um, so let's just go ahead and get started. I'm thinking what we're gonna do is orange for the background of the pumpkins. Point you down so you can see what I'm saying. Orange behind here, black on our outlines. You get one. Mm -hmm. And then um, white behind the lettering and black letters. Hello, Lori. Good morning. Well, I'm glad that you're here. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and start with the background pieces and give this, you all right? Give this time um, to get drying. So that way when we're ready to move on to the second side, we'll be able to flip it. Um, and let's see. I'm not just used to them pills are sour. Are they? Yeah. Good morning, Jason. Good morning, Lisa. How are you doing today? All right. I am going to use my sponges. Can you stop chomping that, please? Or you're going to have to spit it out. Nobody wants to listen to that. Thank you. But no one wants to listen to that. Okay. All right. I'm just going to do some white. And I'm not going to get close to my edges because I'm going to use the sponge when I get to the sides. So that way I don't go over and make a big mess onto my edges since this is a porch sitter and it's going to be seen from multiple sides potentially. I don't want to have it messy. Hi guys. Here's Preston. He's down here with us for a bit this morning. Good morning Robin. He is going to take off. Where's your iPad? Go get your iPad and then you can see comments on yours instead of having to be right up here. I want to be right here. I like it. Okay, press. Um, My friend. I don't know what I was saying. Anyways. Hi Marilyn. Hello, Marilyn. Good morning, Robin. Good morning, uh, Tracy. How are you? All right. Just getting the white on here, and I definitely did not grab enough, but that's all right. We'll grab some more in just a second. Preston is getting ready to take off today on his long road trip with my parents and my aunt, and so he will not be live with us again for a couple of weeks. Good morning, Lynn. Um, so he wanted to come on and say hi to you guys today before he takes off. So we may not, um, we'll see how, how long it takes us to finish this. We've got to go get some breakfast and we got to finish packing. Good morning, Carol from Indiana. First time watching from Virginia. Good morning, Brenda. Good morning, Janet. All right, now I'm going to go to the sponge and I'm going to point you guys down a little bit farther so you can see. Preston, you're chomping your gum. This way, I just do not get, um, I have a nice clean edge, okay? So I don't have it all over the place. 
Oops, the comments are going fast today. Robin says, hi, Preston. Hi. What does my shirt say? It says, leggings, leaves, and lattes, please. I got it online. I'm not sure how you say the name of that company. I'll have to text or type it into the comments to you after the live. Is it a Chinese company? Yes. That's probably why you can't understand it. <clears throat> Okay, press. I'm not trying to be mean. I don't care if the comments are not happening today. You're in a mood, and I don't appreciate it right now. All right. So there's just our little background of the white. It's going to be black on the base <clears throat> and around the edges, so I'm not too worried about that. And I'm going to come back through here and, well... Let me add some white down here just to make sure we've got enough. Last time I thought I went down far enough, I did not. So I can always come back through and repaint over top of that with the black. It'll be easier. All right, and then my background for the pumpkins today are going to be orange. Good morning, Terry. Good morning, Teresa, Anna. First time from Georgia, welcome. <laughs> Janet says you best listen to your mama. He's, um. He's having a hard time listening. He's excited to go on his trip, but that's not an excuse for being naughty, and that's what he's doing today, so. Good morning, is it Lana? All right. And I'm just probably gonna use just the sponge on my pumpkins. It's just probably a little bit easier than, it gives it more of a consistent texture. I kind of like that. So maybe I'll go back over and do the whole, oh goodness, look what I just did. Put my other sponge right in the orange. Presto, can you get your iPad? Because I'm having a hard time keeping up with the comments and then you'll be able to see them from your iPad easier. Can I just watch them from this? No, that can't come over here. Oh, can I just watch them like this? Oh, yeah, I thought you said my computer. I don't want that over here because I got the water. Uh, uh, that, that, no, not the computer. What? Okay. Melba? Melba, good morning. Did you say good morning to Anna? Yep. Morning, Anna. I think this is going to be cute and it can be used for quite a while because it's, like I said, double sided. Nope, no excuses. You get to control your words. Yes, ma'am, that is correct. She must be a mom, geez. She must be, <laughs> she must be a mom, he says. New from Northeast Tennessee. Good morning, Connie. Welcome. Good morning, Mary. Good morning, Lynn. Oh, no, we're freezing every few seconds. We actually had some really bad storms come through this week and knock out our power um, for a couple of days. So it might still just be a bad connection in the area. Video keeps getting interrupted. I'm sorry, guys. I hope that that stops. I hope that it gets better. Yeah, we had a one tree take down a, a phone line, so that could be part of it. We uh, we had a bunch of trees in the area taken down. The schools were closed, so. The community college golf course was. Yeah. All right, we get this background done, and then we can start on our little details, which brings it all together. Yes, please, please. Um, Follow and, and like and share and all the things. Hey, New from you Indianapolis. Good morning, Jan. When you, when you pop on, make, be sure to tell us where you're watching from. A lot of them are saying where they're coming on from, so that's good. We Preston really likes to see where you guys are coming on from, so definitely keep telling us. We are in Michigan, Lynn. The other day, what was it? Was it Tuesday when the storms came through, Preston? Yeah. I think it was oh, Tuesday. The hail. It was beautiful out Tuesday morning. We went, we just went for a walk and I got back online after my lunch and was working and all of a sudden it got like black outside and we had a giant hail and it knocked down trees all over the place. Um, there was a giant one uh, right outside the subdivision. There was a giant one in the subdivision. There was a giant one in the subdivision, yep. Um, so it took out our power for a couple of days and it, 
Um, I actually like put holes or ripped off part of the roof on the elementary school that was down the road. So that was closed. And then there's a golf course that had a bunch of trees uprooted and the college was closed. I don't know. So campus workers said, um, it was like 20 some trees, like 26 trees uprooted at the um, community college. Yeah, right down, a, right down the line, there was a bunch of them. All right, so I'm gonna put this aside. There's our background. Preston, you gotta sit still, babe. I am not sure if I'm near Kelly. What part of Michigan? We are in, we're in Muskegon, so what are we considered? We're West Michigan. Lori is in Ocean Springs. Lisa's in Kentucky. Where's uh, Ocean Springs at? I missed it, bud. It's going. It's um, The comments are going quick today. Hi, Debbie. All right, so there's our background. Hi, Debbie. I'm going to set that aside. Thank you. If you see him, come on. You, you can say hi to him, too. Hello, Debbie. Bell. Battle Creek. Oh, you're not that far, then. Not that far at all. You're not all by right. Kalamazoo. Is that? I'm... I'm bad with my directions from where I am. I know where things are at to like get there, but all right, I'm gonna go ahead where and add did you some get the black. Pumpkins? This is actually available on my website. So I put the link in the description. If you're interested, you can purchase the blank. Um, Mississippi. Mississippi. All right, switching over to black guys. And I'm gonna do, so these are ones I've used. I gotta try and keep these separated so I don't make a giant mess. I'm gonna use black on the, um, outline I guess is what I'm calling it here and then on my words and this will probably take two coats maybe a second three. coat yeah probably just two maybe three we don't know yes you never know but probably just two good morning newbie from Mississippi Gulf Coast good morning good well, morning welcome happy to have you here you do a good job bud Enjoy your trip, Preston. Great help reading the comments from mom. Thank you. Thank you, Janet. <laughs> um. He's going to miss you guys. He likes coming on live. So I said, well, you've got, we've got, Hi, Melba. we've got all of his stuff packed. Basically. We just need to go through it one more time. Make sure we're not missing anything. Um, and, and get it was, loaded in the car. So. My pop was home at noon today. Yeah. All right, there's our first, there's like a paint booger on there. There's our first little coat on our outline. We'll sit in between the sponges. No, I don't want to sit it on there, do I? Indiana, about 15 minutes in Michigan. Oh, you're not far from us either. Love your positive voice, Preston. You are making people's hearts smile, bud. Aw, thanks, Aww, Janet. Thank you, That's Janet. So nice. Thank you, Janet. That's so nice. Hello from Wisconsin. Preston seems like a great kid. Thank you, Michelle. He is a great kid for the most part, but you know, they're kids and they all have their bad days like I'm the rest of us. I'm saucier just down the road from you, Lori. Hello from Wisconsin. How exciting. Oops, goodness, I got it stuck right on there. I'm so excited to see this one all finished, guys. Hey, it's hello, turn Terry. Out so cute. I did just get, so I was out of wood. I had a lot of orders last weekend and I thought I had more wood than I did, but I ended up running out. So I did finally get wood back in on Tuesday, just before, um, just before the storm, just before the power went out. So then I wasn't able to do anything, but I am caught up on orders now and I have a whole stack of wood. I got two orders in and I got one more coming. So lots to cut. Holy crap, I got that whole stack of wood there. Yeah, yep, there's a bunch there. there. I'll be good for a while. Yep, and I just found, like I said, I just ordered some more too. So, all right. So, let me just show you guys again. If anybody's hopped on here new, we're painting this double-sided porch or porch leaner. Oh my goodness, porch. 
It's not a porch anything. <laughs> <laughs> Shelf sitter, guys. Oh my goodness, I'm losing Ow, it. I know. Um, it's gonna have this around the edge. I'm trying not to, I don't wanna smear anything because this could have some uh, wet paint on there. And then it's gonna say trick or treat. And then we got these cute little jack-o'-lanterns that are gonna um, go over the top of it. And then mm -hmm. the back side will paint next and that will have happy harvest and some cute um, everyday pumpkins. Okay, it looks like they're having a conversation between themselves. That's good. I need a drink real quick. Back up a little bit, bud. We'll just uh, stay <clears> out of that. No, it's okay. I just, I can't keep up with the comments, so. Oh. All right, now, what are you doing? You're moving my table. You got a paint can hold Look it, though. You moved my table. You've got to sit still. That's why I tell you to, to sit still. Porch shelf, right? Well, I mean, whatever. Same difference. <laughs> they <laughs> sit on things, right? Okay. Oh, you know what? I'm messing up again. I was going to do, those are orange. These are going to be black on this part. So I'm still on the black. I'm sorry, guys. I'm, You're losing it. I'm losing it this morning. Mm -hmm. I got a lot on my mind, a lot to get done. And she's, she's just kind of a happy gal right now. I'm she calls this day gal. get out day. Yeah. I told him it's get out day. Mm -hmm. Just trying to lighten the mood of leaving for so long. We haven't been apart that long, so. All right, there's one jack-o'-lantern. I'm gonna do the little noses here real quick. What grade are you in, Preston? Eighth. Eighth grade. Pretty sure it keeps showing the same people watching. Yeah, it probably is. Good morning, Lynn. I don't think I said good morning to Lynn yet. Good morning, Sherry. Good morning, Teresa. Oops. Oh my goodness. I am a mess. Good morning, today. Sherry. That's a new one. Oh, good morning, Sherry. I was gonna say I just said good morning, but you're right, that's a new one. This is the boring part, watching this, I know, but we like to talk with you, boring. so just I, chat with us, I guess. Mm -hmm. Does Preston ever craft too? Yes, he does. Um, not as often. He used to love to. We always, especially around the holidays, he'll probably be <laughs> uh, on more often. Uh, my teenage daughter is so over my crafting. <laughs> no, he likes to craft too, but usually just more around the holidays, so we'll be on more. We've got what some What is your more... favorite subject? Math. All right, quit cutting me off though, okay? You can hold that in your thoughts until I'm done talking and then you can answer it. Um, Good morning to you both, said Lulu. What was her question? No, hold on a minute. The crafting, yes. So we have pumpkins that we're gonna come on and paint again together with you guys. And then we do a little ornament party. We'll paint Christmas ornaments and we like to do uh, gingerbread houses and haunted houses and things like that. Everybody spread the... Do you cut the wood with a laser? Yes, I do. And I actually use MDF. It's my favorite to paint and cut and everything. I have a Glowforge, the pro model. Everybody spread the DD love. Thank you, yes. Let's see, there was another comment up here I thought I missed. Good morning, Elizabeth. Someone just commented. Okay, and you did answer your favorite subject in school. Did you get to that yeah, one? Yeah, but math. Okay. My four-year-old lives to craft with me. <laughs> yeah, see, when he was younger, he loved to do that stuff. But now that he's getting older, it's he still does it, but it's not his favorite. My favorite thing is sitting on my iPad. Yeah, that's not something that we do all day, though, is it? I play in the basement a lot. We play outside. I kind of get mad sometimes when she comes down here and follows me. All right. Okay, so there's our little... Um, details for this hi side. amy so let me run the dryer over this real quick i love to support my fellow crafting That's sisters great. when i can well thanks janet we all appreciate your support we like to support each other you always learn something new, you know? Everybody you watch has, even if you're doing, like, Amy the same Murphy. thing, everybody paints things different or crafts things different. I spread the DD love. 
Amy, he's leaving today. He's leaving um, in just a little bit. So he came on live this morning, and then we're going to go finish making sure we got everything packed up. Oh, we're going to breakfast first. We're going to go hungry. get breakfast first. Yep, yeah, we'll go get breakfast. Here. I didn't think it was supposed to rain today, and all of a sudden I was in the car doing something, and all of a sudden I hear rain. I'm like, and it just started downpouring. I didn't mm -hmm. know it was supposed to rain. So we do got to really work, though, on you quitting, cutting people off, okay? When someone's talking, you got to wait your turn. Morning, Patricia. Morning, Becky. Just kind of lining this up to show you where we're at so far, and then we'll flip them over and do our other side. Hang on, I got an idea for the noses. Nope, leave them alone a minute. Leave them alone a minute. Flip we're not. Way. I know, but we're not done. I'm just showing them Would kind of where we're way? at. So here's our first um, side, and I think once I get them glued on, I might paint the insides of like the nose and the mouth and the eyes yellow to make it look like he's um, lit up like a jack-o-lantern. Learned so much from watching all the crafters. Yes, I love, I watch crafting. I don't necessarily watch it, um, Hi, but I have West it Tennessee running here. almost all day long. Preston, once again though, was I talking? Yep. Yes, you have got to stop doing that. <coughs> you do it all day long to everybody. She will done with some of it, I think. So I'm gonna go ahead and paint on the back side now. He is exciting. He is, yes, definitely exciting or excited. Good morning, Regina. Doing a great job. Preston, I think. has a granddaughter your age. Oh, uh -huh. That's exciting. All right, let's see. So on I... the back side, what did I say I was going to do? I'm going to do white, black. Did we say we're going to do? We're going to do cream on the backgrounds of these pumpkins. All right, so. You can keep reading comments. I'm just. I really to love myself. this design. I really like this design. Oh, thank you. I think good it's manners be are super, super cute. Good manners are super important. I tell my kids that all, all of them, all, all the time. Oh yeah. Okay. Sometimes yes. I have we're hard working time. on not cutting people off. He's really good at thinking that he has to come good first in a conversation. Tiffany. Good morning, Tiffany. Good morning, Debbie. I think I've just seen that one again. Might have. I don't know. All right, I'm going to go back through with paintbrush on the background just because it moves it along a little bit faster. And then I'll do my edges with the sponge um, to keep that nice and clean on my sides. Apparently, Facebook is notorious for putting the same people on there. Mm-hmm. Preston, we don't need to keep making those kind of comments, though. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Morning, Kathy. So, without telling what day is for safety, I mean, I'm sure everybody here is nice and not bad people, but you never know who watches the replays. Don't tell them what days you plan on being in places, but why don't you give them a little rundown of where all you're going and what, what things you're going to do, like what states and what we're gonna parks. Be, we're going to do Mount Rushmore. We're going to do Yellowstone. We're going to do Sturgis, Wild Drug. Uh, we're going to do Yosemite, Sequoia, Las Vegas, Hoover Dam, Grand Canyon. Good morning, Kathy. In those states, you're going to probably be South Dakota, Wyoming, uh, California, Nevada, and Arizona. Yep, so they are going all over the place. And we're driving it, so. And they're driving it, but they're going to be gone for 17 days, I think it is. 16. 16 or 17, depending on when you guys get back. So I'm going to count it as 17. Then I'll be excited if they get home sooner. Good manners will take you far. Absolutely. Good morning, Terry. Sounds like a great trip. Enjoy your enjoy your mom is gonna miss you i am definitely gonna miss him Absolutely. she wants me out right now no i don't it's a joke i said that because you started getting nervous about going so i said oh no when that day comes you are out of the house you're not staying hi all right then i'm gonna use some light buttermilk i think is my background i think um let me see i think this is the color i want though Yeah, we're going to go with it. If it Lucky. doesn't look good afterwards, we'll recolor it. Just you and your grandparents, so much fun. Yes, my aunt is going too, so his great aunt is going to go with him. Um, Lucky. I am so awesome. jelly, Preston. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy every moment. 
I think that was a typo. No jelly like jealous goofball. Oh, I don't know <laughs> that stuff. I know, it's okay. I don't know if you can really tell the difference between this cream color and the white. We'll see. I don't know what, what one is which right now. It might look good though with the tops on. We'll see. If we don't like it, we can fix it. We can cover back over it. Oh, you have to finish that tear chair right there? Yes. You haven't done nothing with that for a while. I've been busy. Yes, and then hopefully next year I am better and I am able to travel because I would like to go with them next time. I would have loved to have gone this time, but we I can beyond barely today. walk without getting sick. We so. would be on today if she was going. Nope, we would not be, would we? We'd be. And she would have packed my stuff. Yes, you wanted to be in charge of packing your own stuff this time, so I didn't get to help you. I, I was in charge of packing my own stuff last time. I don't know. I think you can see the difference. We'll see, though. Yeah, it's a little... It's not much different, but I think when I'm we like get the um, pieces gotta, on there. I'm always starting to hurry. Okay, if you have to go upstairs, that's fine. No, I mean, I'm getting hungry. Oh, well, we're going to be done here. We should be done in about half an hour, maybe not even that long. Okay, and then we'll go get you your McDonald's. He loves McDonald's breakfast burritos. Oh, Preston. Excuse me. <laughs> Yeah, he's not, he doesn't necessarily know all of that teen lingo yet, so I'm, I'm happy about that. Listen to all the stories your grandparents and aunt want to tell you. Yes, you will. Definitely enjoy the stories. And the trip is just going to be amazing. I'm so jealous. Oh, mom, I'm wearing a new pair of pants. Yeah? Oh. Mm-hmm. I'm just riding the sweatpants today because it's comfortable. Yeah, that's how I would go too. Nice and comfy. We bought a, a can of uh, butt spray for the trip. Preston, seriously, those are the kinds of things that you don't need to talk about on the live, okay? The credit, um. Yes, you give way too much detail. I will hide now behind you. Sit up, you're not gonna be behind me like that. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go back. Are you all packed, Preston? Yes, basically. I think he's got everything. We're gonna run back through it one more time when we get done here. After, after breakfast, yes, after breakfast. Mm. I know we gotta eat. Um, Our boys gotta eat. The boys gotta eat, yes. Mm. So after breakfast, I'm gonna run back through it, but I think he's got everything packed and ready to go. Okay. Well, let's move this aside again. Mm. We'll work on our happy harvest. This is the last part of just black and white boring colors, and then we can do some fun stuff with the rest of it. We get chipmunks in our garage. Yes, we have, we call them Elvin, don't we? No, we call or them Theodore. Theodore. My mom goes up to get a root beer sometimes and they run across her feet. Preston. Oh. Again, that's not a bad thing that you just said, but you give too much detail. Sometimes when we go out in the garage, the chipmunks run over our feet. You don't need to give every detail to every person, okay? Preston, quit. Here, let me hold that down. On fall break from school. No, we homeschool Janet. So he, um, we actually, we homeschool year round anyways, but we did start three weeks earlier this time. Um, so that way he does not need to take any book work with him. And besides, I mean, you're going to learn so much on this trip that you cannot learn from a textbook anyways. So... No need to take his books with them. Let me grab some more black paint. Honey, quit. That noise doesn't seem loud to us, but that can seem really loud in the camera, okay? Look, you can see my foot moving back and forth. Yep. Oh, look at that. Okay, quit, please. All right, there's our happy harvest. And now let's do some fun colors for our pumpkins. 
Let's see, what I was thinking is doing this one just traditional orange again, and then doing sea breeze and bluegrass green. I'm thinking bluegrass, bluegrass green on the chevron pumpkin, and then the sea breeze on the polka dot pumpkin. Preston, you are very mature for your age. Your mom should be very proud. Thank you. I am, for the most part, right, Preston? We just gotta work on a few little things, but you are. All right, let's do... I don't really spend time with her anymore either. I usually am outside. Who, me? No, I am. I know, you don't spend time with me, is that what you're saying? Yeah. Yeah, I know, you don't. I don't, I don't really like you anymore. That's all good, dude. I'm always with my grandparents. Yeah, you like to spend time with your grandparents. All right. We're football maniacs. Mm-hmm. Love those colors. Thank you. Aw, super cute. That's what someone said. So there's our little orange pumpkin. <sighs> Press no. I'm sorry, that was bad. I didn't mean to do that. Of an accident. Okay, let's not carry on about it then, okay? Let's do our bluegrass green. Did I say that right? Bluegrass green. I think I said that right. For our chevron pumpkin here. Okay, Press, you need to go upstairs for a minute. Excuse me. I'm done yeah, now. No, no, I'm done now, Mom. Okay, if it happens again, you need to go upstairs, like I said. Instead of arguing and listen you're leaning again that's how you fell the first time and you're bumping the camera good morning susan this little makeup sponge didn't get cleaned last time i used it so it's not working as well but about done just about done, yeah. You're not gonna put it all together right now? I'm not gonna glue it all together right now, no. We're just gonna paint it and show off what it's gonna look like when it's finished. I still have to cut the base of it anyways. I forgot to do that before. I cut this out ahead of time knowing that I'd be limited on time and then I actually forgot to get it on the website so I had to get it up on the website this morning um, before we went live. So I didn't have time to cut the base but I'll get that cut and painted and then I'll post a picture of it all when it's finished too. So there is our cute little chevron one. And what is this one? This was our cream one. Let me see. This one's dry. I can use this one. Had family reunion in the Frankenmuth. Oh, that is, I've never been there, but I hear it's absolutely beautiful. In Frankenmuth, Michigan. Yes. Family in Mount Pleasant, Cadillac, and some other northern cities in Michigan. We've been in Cadillac before. Yep. All right. This is my favorite color right here. The sea, sea breeze, I think it is, right? Yeah, sea breeze. I especially love to do, like, my trucks in the sea breeze color got little fuzzies all over my makeup brush here or sponge whatever honey you're chomping again why am i picking eye boogers all right and then our little blue polka dot pumpkin yes when i was little my grandpa um always had his own planes and when we were when I was little he flew us to Mackinac so that was my first trip was on my grandpa's plane to Mackinac and then last year um, my parents took him to Mackinac and they spent a long weekend there so how long have you had your Glowforge? Um, I have had mine just about a month it actually doubled my sales for this year from January to July I doubled from August when I got my machine to now so I think it's worth it been to Mackinac Island we got that one do I use PayPal I do my um, website all goes through PayPal you can either use PayPal to purchase or you can just use a credit card it will let you process it that way 
Um, and I also use PayPal for invoicing as well. Well, someone's interested in something. Maybe, yep. Mm -hmm. Mackinac has changed so much. I haven't been there in a long time. Like I said, I went there when I was a kid, and then I haven't been able to travel. I got sick uh, with chronic vertigo about two and a half years ago now, and so I really am just stuck at home. I can't do much of anything right now, so... But Mackinac is beautiful, and I would love to go there again one day, too. All right, so I already showed you guys that part. Let me run the dryer over these real quick just to make sure there's no wet paint that gets smeared I'm on our background. I'm obsessed with the bridge. Yes, you like the bridge, don't you? Yep. All right, I think we're good. I don't think anything's still wet. So let me lay this up. Did I paint the wrong side? I painted the wrong side on all these. I did paint the wrong side on that pumpkin, so I'll have to go back and redo that, but I can line it up and kind of show you the the idea, at least, is what it's going to look like. It'll just be backwards. This is not the first time she's painted something on the wrong side. Just hush. <laughs> I, I do that often. All right, so there we go. Happy harvest. Do you guys like it like this, or should we do something different with the background? I do kind of like it. I like it. Do you like it? I think it makes it just look nice and bright. I like it. I think I like it like that. Oh, great. I'm so sorry. Prayers for your healing. Oh, thank you. I'm way better. I mean, two years ago when I first got sick, I could barely walk. I had to wake up and then I walk her to the bathroom. Yeah, I could barely walk. I was stuck in bed for a good six months. So I'm doing a lot better than I was, but I still can't drive. Um, I drive down to like, we have GNL down the road. It's like two miles away. I can go there and back on a good day. Um, you go to the UPS store quite often. Um, but for the most part, I'm just stuck at home. Robin likes it. Jackie says joining late. That's all right, Jackie. Welcome. We're happy to have you. All right. So I think I think that's what we're going to do. I think we're going to leave it like this. I may do a second coat of You're my... You're not going to flip the pumpkin? Yeah, no, no, no. I am. I'm going to fix the pumpkin. I painted it black blackwards. <laughs> I painted it backwards. I painted the wrong side of the pumpkin. So I'm going to paint the correct side of the pumpkin so that he actually you know, goes on there like this. I don't know how I did that wrong, but whatever, it happens. Um, and then let me show you the other side for those that are just hopping on, because I know we got some people on here that just joined it's us. It's hard to flip sides. So here's our other side, and this one's going to say trick or treat, and it has some cute little jack-o'-lanterns. Preston, you're chomping way too loud, please. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to miss you all, too. Yes, he's going to miss you all. He loves coming on here live and interacting. So when he gets back, we'll come on and do some lives again. But if you're not following me yet, make sure you're following me because since I'm going to be home by myself for the next 17 days, potentially, I will be live quite a bit doing some fun projects. So, all right, there's our other side with the trick or treat. And again, I did link um, the blank. Let me... Let me keep painting while I chit chat with you. I'll work on my other side of my pumpkin and fix that. Um, I did post the link to the blank if you're interested. It's on my website. Which Glowforge did I get? I know they have a few different ones. Okay, so I did go with the Pro. Um, if you're not going to do large things, the Pro's not needed. The Pro, there's some positives with the pro the pass through so if you're gonna use if you're making like I do door hangers but I haven't really done a lot with the pass through to be honest um so the pass through is a plus for the pro and then it does have the all day it's got like a cooling I don't remember what it's called but it, it cools itself so it can print or cut all day long without having to take breaks where the other machines you can only do for so long and then they need to cool down um and I also did get the filter so that I don't have to vent it outside. So altogether, it was like $7,500 for all of that. Now, like I said, if you're only doing small things like tiered tray stuff and ornaments and things like that, the pro's not necessary. You could go with one of the smaller models um, and save yourself a little bit of money. So there we go. I fixed the orange. Let's see here. Double-sided project, fantastic, so cute. Thank you, Susan. 
Jackie loves that it's two-sided as well. Let me go. I'm going to go grab um, one of the projects that I did just do with my pastor. Can you get up and move out of the way, please? You're going to have to move because i got to walk through there. there. Yes, get up and move, please. You're not listening to me. Move. I have to move? Yes. Thank you. Playing with my toes right now. But you have to play with your ears a minute. You have to listen. Okay. All right, so I did just do this with my pass-through. It is for like a wedding book. So they'll sign, her guests will sign their names on here and then they'll be able to use it as decor. So this turned out, let's see here. Here's my little, I think it's 19 inches tall. So yep, 19 by 20. So the bed on the Glowforge is like 12 by 19, I think is the biggest you can cut without having the pass-through. So I did do that on the pass-through, but watch out big. Other than that, most of my stuff is small enough that I don't need the pass-through. And a lot of the files that you can purchase are made to use on any of the machines. So just trying to answer your questions there. Let's see here. Why the sponges instead of a paintbrush? Um, I learned that trick. When I paint with a paintbrush, I'm pretty sloppy. Um, my edges get icky. So when you cut or when you use laser, it's burned on the edges. So it's got that dark black or brown color. And if you use the sponge, you don't have to go back through and repaint your edges because it keeps it nice and neat. So that's wow. why I do that. That is really white in between my toes right there. All right, hold on a minute. I'm trying to read comments. Um, let's see here. All right, I think I got all the comments, guys. So... I'm done early. I don't think the next person comes on until, what did it say, 10 o'clock? No, it'd be 10 o'clock our time, so 9 o'clock central, I think. So you guys got about another hour before the next crafter comes on. But make sure you hang around um, so that you can watch that and learn something new. And if you're not following me yet, please follow me. I will be live probably for the next 17 days. So I'll be around quite a bit. And uh, do you have anything you want to say before you take off? Um. Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye, guys. I will see you soon. Have a great weekend.